This is Fiba podcast. Thank you for joining us in our morning daily devotion. Let's continue to look at the third I am statement that Jesus made in John's gospel. I am the door. John chapter 10 verses 7 and 9. It's a very interesting concept that Jesus introduces here talking about the significance of people coming through the door we see in verse 1 where he says anyone who does not enter the sheep pen by the gate but climbs in by some other way is a thief and a robber the one who enters by the gate is the shepherd of the sheep the gatekeeper opens the gate for him and the sheep listen to his voice he calls his own sheep by name and leads them out the next statement we're going to look at tomorrow is i am the shepherd but before that jesus here talks about the importance of the door now in a house we all know that everybody who needs to enter the house they have a key and they open the door and they go in and if somebody is coming through the balcony or through the back door generally are considered people who don't have a legal entry into the house so they try to either break the window or come through the balcony and generally jesus is saying like these are whom we know today as thieves and robbers but if you carefully look at verse 7 jesus is here makes an interesting point he says since he is the gate for all his sheep he says that only those who enter through that gate will be saved that means what he is saying is that anyone who believes in jesus christ would make it into heaven and he is saying that there is no other way and if we see that in verse 10 the thief comes only to steal and kill and destroy but i have come that they may have life and have it to the full so what jesus is saying is listen people will come through different doors and trying to enter into the house to steal and destroy but those who come through the door that is the jesus christ are the ones that are going to be saved we see jesus here contrasted himself as the door with the thieves and robbers who preceded him and in fact actually here he is uh, talking about people who come through other means and instead of providing protection to the sheep they are the ones who exploit them they are the ones who hurt them or they are the ones who abuse them and in fact there is a reference here about israel's uh, former leaders in that particular time who have been those who have been exploiting the people and today we also find this very common among our world sometimes there are people who exploit us even within the churches we see people being used people being exploited whereas we know that it was jesus who laid down his life for his friends my friends as you listen to this devotion this morning for me it's very exciting to know that when i believe in jesus and when i walk through that door and enter his house i have the joy of feeling safe the joy of knowing that i am secure and have the joy of knowing that my salvation is sealed and it is exciting for us as christians as those who believe in the lord saying that we also have an assurance of salvation but it's very important it's very important that we walk through that door that means walking not just believing but also walking through that door knowing that you will going to shut off yourself from all the other distractions and enjoy the safety and security that jesus brings in so my friends as his sheep as his followers no matter what the tensions we face no matter what the struggles we face what we hear from this statement or what we learn from this statement that jesus is making is that security comes from him i am the bread of life he is our sustainer 
I am the light of the world. He is the one who dispels darkness or enlightens us. I am the door, which means a promise that Jesus is saying that I am going to protect you. I am going to ensure that you are safe and secure. Dear listener, we are here to stand with you in your time of need. We want to pray with you and for your prayer request. Do you need someone to talk to? We are here for you. Call us or send a message at plus nine one six three six four two five two one six four plus nine one six three six four two five two one six four. God bless you. Thank you.